here today with Trevor Ryan from Waco. Now Trevor, the majority of fridges out in vehicles these days are electric powered. What do fridge users need to know about the way these fridges are powered? I guess, Simon, there's several ways that you can actually power a fridge while you're driving. It's important to have the right wiring when you're in your vehicle, so if you're getting the right power from the battery to the rear of a car, that's probably the most important factor. The reason for this is something called voltage drop or resistance for your wiring. So if your wiring is too small, you lose power physically through your wire. The downside to the factory fitted plugs is most manufacturers only put 3 mil wiring to the plug, which means it's not enough to power your fridges, and it doesn't matter what brand of fridge is, they still suffer the same fate, voltage drop. So then Trevor, why do most manufacturers supply their fridges with a cigarette lighter on the end of the plug? It's primarily for convenience. Every car has a cigarette lighter plug. Most of the full drivers out there actually upgrade their plugs to a merit plug because it's far more secure for wiring. Most quality manufacturers will give you an accessory to put the correct wiring or a merit plug in the rear of your vehicle so that you do get that secure connection while you're doing those corrugations and full driving scenarios. Trevor Ryan from Waco, thank you very much for your time. My pleasure. Thank you, Simon. Thank you for Drive TV.